Hello everyone, this is Fani. Today I come up with a topic dust explosion. In this session, I am going to talk about what is dust explosion, dust causes explosion and why, few case studies of dust explosion incidents and hierarchy of controls to dust explosion. A dust explosion is a fast combustion of dust particles suspended in the air in an enclosed location. Combustible dust is finally divided into solid particles that can create an explosion when ignited. Examples are organic materials, metals, coals and even plastic dust. Let us see how this dust explosion occur. We all know that the ingredients necessary to start a fire remember fire triangle which represents fuel, oxygen and heat. When talking about combustible dust, we add two more ingredients, dispersion and confinement. This is what referred to as the dust explosion pentagon. To occur dust explosion, all these five ingredients must in place. Many facilities that have process that produces dust fine particles may at risk of explosion often with catastrophic results unless precautions are taken and proper procedures are followed. Text explosion have a history. The first document explosion on December 14, 1785 in Turin, Italy. On 7th February 2008, the eyes of the world were opened to the hazard of combustible dust when the Imperial Sugar Refinery, Georgia, US, the blast killed 14 people and injured 36 others. And the recent explosion on September 29, 2019 in Chenderia, India leaves 15 people injured at Billa Cement Works. Dust control is the most important factor in preventing fires or explosions in any dust generating workplace. The effective dust control can reduce the risk of catastrophic fire or explosion in the workplace. The most effective way to reduce the risk associated with combustible dust is to eliminate its source. Next one, by using different processes that doesn't generate any dust. Engineering controls make a physical modification to facilities, equipment and processes to reduce exposures like dust collectors. Then apply administrative controls, change your work practices and policies and provide awareness tools and trainings to limit the risk of combustible dust. Some of the administrative controls are developing dust management programs, effective manual cleanup and housekeeping programs. When come to personal protective equipment is not an effective control measure for combustible dust explosions, use proper respirators, IVA and protective clothing while working with dust atmospheres. Let us see some of the controls for prevention of dust explosions at workplace. Ventilation systems, especially local adjust ventilation near the source. Use of dust collection equipment. Place vents on equipment where a dust explosion could occur. Separation of heat and ignition source from combustible dusts. Using spark detection systems. Using wet or damp work methods. Adopting an aggressive cleaning programs that is good housekeeping, using vacuum or wet cleaning instead of dry sweeping or compressed air cleaning, employee training and supervision and proper PPE. And let us see some of the equipments installed at work areas to control this dust explosions, dust collectors, powder conveying system, double wall hoppers, explosion vent rotary wall, fire suppression system. Let me brief this presentation. A dust explosion is the fast combustion of dust particles suspended in the air in an enclosed location. Dust explosion pentagon includes five triangle elements 
with two additional elements dispersion of dust and confinement of dust many facilities that have process that produces dust fine particles may at risk of explosion often with catastrophic results unless precautions are taken and proper procedures are followed dust control is the most important factor in preventing fires or explosion in any dust generating workplaces this is about dust explosion 